Harold, I know you hate this question, but I feel like I have to ask it. If you own 81% of Continental, and I wonder if you owned 100%, would you have the freedom to run it in the way that you want in terms of pumping the oil that we need without the kind of stress that uh, public companies can get under? Well, Alex, uh, we, we all know that there's, uh, uh, you have to do what the market wants when you're public, and, and that for sure. So. The freedoms of, of these private, uh, yeah, it's, uh, they have more freedom than we do. Uh, you're, you're exactly right. Well, that sets up an interesting question, doesn't it? Um, would, would you, just before, I, I want to ask Bill about, about kind of the macro environment at the moment, but Harold, is that something you're actively thinking about? Would you like that freedom? Well, it's something that, uh, you know, we, uh, we operated with that freedom up to 2007, and, and certainly I know how that feels. Uh, so, you know, when, when the market quits paying you for it, then, then you, have to, uh, you, you have to look at the other side. So are we sitting here yep. with blinders on? No, but uh, as long as we can operate uh, and do so in a manner that uh, is successful, uh, we, would, we would tend to be here.